Howdy, my friends, and welcome back to more Let's Play Grand Turismo 5. This is Sky Hurricane, and hope you're ready for more of this awesome racing adventure here, and hope you're doing great. And you see, we are in our Ford Mustang, Mustang Match 71, and I did not tune this all the way up because I didn't want it to be way, way, way too overpowered. But uh, I did tune it up to 564 horsepower, or no, 531 horsepower, 564 PP performance points. And, uh,. I got racing soft tires on it, so I have a feeling we should easily get victory. So unfortunately, it won't be too much of a challenge, probably, but but we'll see. I may be in for a surprise. Cause we're versing a Cuda, a Challenger, Camaro, SS69, Chevelle, Charger Super B, Corvette Stingray, and a Superbird and a Tempest Man's GTO. And a cougar. So, uh, should be a pretty neat race. I, lo I love mo muscle cars. They're very nice to look at. Don't have the best handling in the world, but, uh, but they are very neat to look at. Oh, yeah, I'm already, already passing them. In my yellow Ford Mustang. Oh, man, this has really good brakes. I'm kind of surprised. Very surprised, actually. Let's see what this thing is made of. Yeah, I assume with a racing exhaust and a racing muffler and stuff like that, it probably would have got well over 600 horsepower. But, you know, like I said, I didn't want to be way too hard on them, you know. Seems like I already tuned it up too much. Ah. Fly off the road. How wonderful. Well, they caught me. They caught me fair and square. Yeah, uh, as I was saying, muscle cars don't have the best handling. Uh, I do have that Chevrolet Corvette 69, and I did it. I think I did it for a regular muscle car championship or something. And uh, it had actually pretty good handling. I like the sound of this car, man. You can tell it's got that big old V8 in it. Yeah, I mean, we are we're getting it. <laughs> oh, wow, well, spinning that wheel. My dad would like that. I tell you, my dad just like a teenager. No offense to any teenagers out there. He likes to spin wheels. Though. Doing very well. Well, this is just one race, so that means this will be rather short in comparison to previous videos. I may do something on in addition to this. As a matter of fact, I think I may start the special events or something. Oh, crap. That wasn't too bad. This has really good acceleration until it gets into the final gear. That's the thing about muscle cars, they all have a real close gear ratio, which I spread this out to go 184, but it take it forever to reach it. Because it just, uh, once it gets past so many RPMs, it just doesn't accelerate very well. You'll, you'll see what I mean when we get on it straight away again. See, they, yeah, like right now it's not, once it gets past 155, it just, just doesn't accelerate very well anymore. Spin that wheel, spin that wheel. Yeah, I'm just creaming them so bad. Once again, I way over tuned. Don't worry, y'all get to see a challenge by the end of this video when I do those special events. 
<laughs> Spin that wheel. Oh yeah. Slow down too early, and now, then I accelerated more than. I just don't know how to drive. Nah, I'm doing all right. I'm too critical. Twenty-five second lead. It'd be over thirty by the time I'm done. Of course, we'll never know because I won't let them finish. You know, this thing does have pretty good brakes, though, I gotta say. You know, that's one thing that's weird about this game, is uh, all cars have the brake balance controller. You don't have to buy that. In every other Gran Turismo before, you always had to buy the racing brakes, you know. Oh man, this car wouldn't go anywhere if the TCS was off with it. <laughs> and you know, back in 1971, it wasn't. They didn't have such a thing, I don't think. And you know, this thing really wouldn't go as fast as it's going now. <laughs> yeah, 31 seconds already. Yeah, we're definitely not going to wait on them to finish. Chevrolet for convertible 69 was second. The one I have was a seventh. I think that's the same one I have. Alright, everybody. So, that is that. That is that. So I guess we can see what we get because I think that's the only race for it. There still is the uh, Missile Car Championship. That, uh, that's in the professional. So I hadn't done that yet. I may have... I did some kind of... I did some kind of race with that Corvette. I forgot what it was. Alright, so we won a, uh, the special. And oh, y'all, man, that is a good car. Okay, so we completed all amateur series. So level 9 coupon acquired. So let's see what we get here. That Buick Special is a very good car, though. And I'm not lying at that. It is very, very, very uh, competitive. It handles so good, too. Yeah, at least it does in Gran Turismo 4. I don't know about this one. Alright, so let's see what that level 9 is. I'm curious to know. Could be anything. Could be something I already have. Hmm. A C63 AMG. Hmm. I'll have to look at that. These are Mercedes of some sort. So yeah, we have over a hundred cars in our garage right now. I don't remember how many I had the first time I played through this game. Oh wow, 436 horsepower. Pretty peppy. Very heavy, though. Looks pretty nice. Pretty nice. 
How many uh, performance points? 495. All right, so uh, special events. I think uh, I'm going to skip the AMG Driving Academy, and uh, I think we're going to do the intermediate of the rally. We're going to start on that. And uh, I'm going to do the first one here, but got to get the right car. So I think we're going to go back to our Lotus Lease. That's what I used the last time, and it's in my favorites. And it did really well in the last time we did this but how will it do now we will be racing faster cars you know uh, Toyota Celica GT4 Audi Quattro 82 and a Mitsubishi Lancer Evolution yeah these are definitely faster than uh, what I dealt with last time Clubman Gravel Rally. Oh yeah, this takes forever to start. Can't forget that. I wonder if it's the same rally or will it be a different track. Seems like it's different than the last time. Which may be a good thing because I didn't do too well with the last one. Uh, should be ready. Shouldn't need to modify my settings any. Oh, the Celica 98. That's the one that I've been wanting to buy. But I can't ever find it in the used cars. Gotta wait our turn. Make me wait forever. Turn this on. I probably should turn on the driving line. It might help for this. I may do that on the next session. You know why? Why not utilize that resource? Although, you know, you do have the guy talking to you. It's not like he really helps, you know. But. Well, I killed I killed him on the amateur, but I don't know how this is going to work. They may kill me. Because, uh, actually, you can have up to 340 horsepower. This only has 260. Oh, yeah, they're beating me so far. You know, heck, we have a sharp curve coming, too. Oh crap. Surprised they didn't give me a penalty for that. I am not the best at rally as you can tell. Let's look at our beautiful car. Six left. Four right. Okay, it looks like we have a 50. sharp curve here. And I hit the wall like an idiot. Oh, I bet you I lost that. Finish. Man, I am not any good at rally. I don't know if they have better car than me or not. Surely not. Yep, man, I lost. I can't tell how many seconds because I can't read my screen. Oh, just one second? That isn't too bad. I think that's a one. All right, so next, I guess. Day one SS2. I should probably cut these loading screens out. They take so daggum long. Ugh. I think I will cut out the next one. Uh, turn the driving light on. Or can I? Oh, I can't turn it on for this. Well, okay. All right, let's start then. Yeah, it looks like uh, this car has uh, outlived its usefulness. I don't know. I have no doubts that I could win this if uh, if I were skilled enough at rally. But obviously, I need a lot more practice. Mm -hmm. 
Alright, let's do this. We need to win this one. We're probably thinking no does. Six left, whatever that means. I know it's a left turn, but I don't know what the six means. Seven right. I wonder if he means what gear you're in. Cause like this car does not have seven gears, I'm pretty sure. Five left. Oh really? Yeah, apparently so. Apparently I should have been in fifth gear. Two right. So obviously I'm gonna lose now. Darn turn. What happened to my car? It just stopped accelerating. Well, I done lost. Wow, I don't even know what happened there. Five right. It just stopped accelerating. One left long. Oh gosh, one. Go, car, geez. When it gets down to first gear, it does not want to accelerate. <sighs> Five right. I hate losing. And I am definitely doing it. Three left long. Go. Maybe I should have picked a manual shift. 5.8 seconds. Yeah, yeah. We well, have lost, I'd say. Unless a miraculous thing happens on the third section. <laughs> they didn't give me a penalty there. I guess they know they know I'm gonna lose anyway, so why give me one? Heck, I can't even catch them. Mm. They're only limited to 346 horsepower, so. But but nevertheless, their skill must be that much better. Six seconds behind now. There's no way to win unless I just really do awesome on this one. Alrighty, all here. So here we go for the third section of this. And from the uh, beginning, when it showed me the little clip, you know, before I started, it looked like an easy section. But I mean, heck, I got gained up, gained by six seconds, so or seven seconds technically. Oh uh, hey, don't expect that to happen. Yeah, I can't, I can't cream these like I did the uh, beginning series. I tell you, they, uh, yeah, say I'm even losing this section. I can't even win one section. So we have this one curve here. Four right. Fifty. He said four, but some reason I went down to second gear. So, Finish. so yeah, yeah. That was a. Uh, epic fail I'd say so uh, in the next part y'all we will be doing this again oh wow I wouldn't last oh, that boosts my confidence slightly <laughs> so in the next part we'll uh, have a different car and uh, try this championship again so it says next well maybe it's not over oh gosh I was hoping it was never mind I guess we'll finish this even though obviously we already know the results all right, everyone, so here we go, this one. And now this one looked real hard. I mean, there were a lot of sharp turns. So uh, who knows how this will go. See, I just, yeah, this car apparently is not the best one for uh, this route because uh, it does not want to take these, cur these curves on uh, dirt. I'm pretty sure it has to have the dirt tires on. I mean, that's why I didn't even check. Because I think it automatically puts them on or else you can't even get in it. Yeah. I should just exit now because we already know the end result, I think. <laughs> but me, I never quit. You know how I am. really is a bad quality I guess especially in this situation well, I'm not losing by too much 
place the cord in the bed. Six left. Nine hundred. It'd be amazing if I won. I'd have to really. Oh wow! I'm actually winning this section. Don't ask me how. Uh, we do have another curve, I think. Seven left. Or not. This is the end. Never mind. Finish. Yeah. I did pretty good on that section, but I don't think it was good enough to uh, take the victory. Oh wow! I I did really good on that section, but yeah, it wasn't good enough. I don't think. It was good enough to get us in third. Oh, it's still not over, really. I guess there are five sections in this. I'm still losing by six seconds, I think. All right, y'all. So here is the last final section, and uh, I'm pretty sure, pretty sure there's no more than five. Come on, car, take this curve, please. That's where they get me, because I know they do that a lot better than I do. And took that curve at like 20 miles an hour for crying out loud. Three long. Now, this car does pretty good on the high speed corners, you know. I should add a penalty there. Oh, come on, car. I see people. Oh, Lord. Yeah, this car doesn't like dirt. But heck, it's a Lotus Elise, you know. It's good on the road, not on the dirt. Speaking of which, uh, I probably still could try the uh, snow and the tarmac with this one. and probably win them. Cause, uh, I actually did better on the beginner with the uh, on those two, <laughs> so I'm sure I would would uh, on the intermediate as well. Yeah, the dirt just to get kicked right now. Come on now, five seconds behind. I'm not surprised. This car's really been struggling. Seven left long. Please tell me we're almost done. We had a long enough straightaway like this, I know I'd catch him. <laughs> Finish. Yay. All right, that's it. That is it. They're playing that music. Oh, boy. Yeah, and I was last by a lot, so I probably got last overall. No, I still got third overall. Barely. All right, y'all, so uh, I'll get my bronze trophy. Yay. So uh, we'll do that again in the next part with a, a different car and see how that goes. I don't know yet what car I'll pick. So, uh, so find out next time. Thank you very much for watching, y'all. Goodbye.